what are your thoughts on universal basic income? I mean, I think a universal basic income in a decadent society probably just sort of deepens decadence. And um, that, that, you know, that if you have a society where people are already being sort of conditioned to lose themselves in virtual amusements and are sort of struggling to do things like get married and have kids, then creating, creating an income that isn't tied to any kind of real world activity, you know, it, it will improve some people's lives, absolutely. Um, but it's likely to sort of lock in that sense of stalemate and futility. Now, maybe I'm underestimating human beings, right? I mean, there's, there's certainly an argument that, you know, if you just, if you give people more money and free them from some of the dead end jobs they're working at, that they will, you know, become more creative and do more creative things. And out of that will come, you know, new businesses, new works of art, you know, marriage, kids, the, the whole bit. Um, but I guess I have a more, I have a more cynical <laughs> view of human nature. And I think that, I think that if you drop the UBI, I mean, th there's a fair amount of evidence that UBIs work pretty well in developing societies, that if you drop a UBI into a society that is sort of growing and dynamic and aspirational, that um, and where, but where there's tons of grinding poverty, that it just lifts people out of poverty and gives them more opportunities. But my suspicion is that if you drop it into a society that's wealthy, already has a social safety net and has a problem with people sort of being stuck in place, then it doesn't actually help. Like if you look at, right, if, if you look at, you know, rural America right now, right, like you have, you know, the, the problem, the problems in rural America are problems of sort of drugs and despair. And it, those are problems that could be solved by, you know, religious revival, um, by forces that sort of encourage people to move out of those communities, um, by jobs returning to those communities. I'm more skeptical that they would be solved by giving everyone in those communities a little more money every month for free.